Welcome back to the Gnome Show, everyone. I'm Joshua, your humble host, and it is my duty, nay, my pleasure, uh, to trawl the briny depths of YouTube so that I may bring you the shinies. I cover short films of varying genres, video games, analog horror and sci-fi, and anything else that I think is groovy. I hope you'll enjoy tonight's offering, content for the blood god. <clears throat> I mean, blood, uh, on with the show. Oh, he wants blood today. Um... Uh, so tonight I have with me uh, uh, my buddy Dave. Uh, he's uh, probably one of my oldest uh, friends. Uh, came up in school together, and then uh, had our own self implosions uh, for a while. And uh, here we are, reforged at the other end of the fucking well, at least at the other end of the mile. Um, got many more to go, but this one, here we are. Um, tonight, uh, we're doing our first, um, um, co-first watch, um, and, um, I call that, uh, my first time being, um, oh, and his being, his time, uh, first time being on video and on, uh, yeah. on air and, like, on YouTube, it's, uh, he's, uh, yeah, it's not a SAG card, but, uh, welcome to YouTube, brother. I'm no, um, uh, what's the word, uh? I'm sort of the uh, the computer science theory guy. I don't uh, discord and stuff. Uh, he has smarts. Yeah, basically, I, I'm a very nerdy, uh, newbie person, I guess, to what everybody's used. You damn kids these days. <laughs> anyway, Josh, I don't know what to say, honestly, man. But um, yeah, this is my friend Josh. Uh, we go long back, way back in the day. We just uh, reconnected, uh, trying to. Uh, what you do with friends, you reconnect, you know? Yeah, reconnect. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Time. And, yeah. um, just trying to, just hey, whatever. Roll with it. All right. Uh, well said, sir. And if you ever, uh, if you ever want, uh, well, yeah, go ahead. Sorry. <laughs> um, brother. let's, uh, let's jump right into it. We don't have much time. I have to go to bed. I have uh, a smoke shop to uh, run tomorrow. Um, so, uh, tonight we're watching Pathosis. Uh, it's um, a short film by Womp Stomp Films. Uh, the same guys that uh, bring you Never Hike Alone. Um, I haven't seen it yet, but uh, my buddy Dave here has. He says it's wonderful. Um, um, and... Um, uh, we'll probably cover this when we haven't been waffling for three hours. Uh, so, um, uh, yeah, let's do this. Um, well, well, before that, let me just uh, say it's wonderful if you're uh, if you grew up in the in the era of Friday Thirteen. You have a very nostalgic uh, desire for that. If you if you grew up in the '80s and you were looking for um, some kind of film, Womp Stomp, there, Never Hike Alone. When you when you consider fan films alone, it's 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 the best one I've seen. Like you know, it, it, expect the cheese. I'm not you know, but it, it's fun. That's all I want to say. Go ahead, man. All right. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Um, there's nothing better than word of mouth. You can't even pay for that kind of fucking uh, advertising. So, um, yes, and if you'd like to know anything about Friday the Thirteenth that you that nobody else cares about, you know, I'm 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 willing to go ahead and just dump my <laughs> my knowledge that nobody. You really know cares what? About. <laughs> um, maybe uh maybe um maybe down the road we'll um I'll just give him the microphone and he can fucking uh uh gush about Friday the Thirteenth for a while. He's actually been to uh, Camp Crystal Lake or at least the lake, anyway. Um, so one of these days I'll have him tell you about that. Um, but, uh, let's jump into Pathosis. Right, it, um, grab your drink, grab your snack, grab your smoke. Let's boogie, guys. Uh, boop. And doop. And, all right, here we go.
It's already got a very Alfred Hitchcock vibe to it. Italian. I'm sorry. I guess you caught me snooping. Marky got it for me on one of his trips to Rome. It reminded him of me. It's beautiful. I see the resemblance. Of course, that was long ago. Before he met you. Weird tattoo on the back of her neck. That's harsh. I think I'll retire for the evening. Nancy? Thank you for inviting me into your home. You're very welcome, Sam. I am just delighted that you're part of the family. Oh, don't. See, um, when I was a kid, um, I learned fairly quickly, um, like, uh, and, like, uh, like we're all guilty of doing this sometimes like like um feeling hard done by or disrespected and then like I'm mocking someone after you like have uh, been nice um uh in front of them um whether they had like um been rude to you or not um sometimes when you're kind to somebody and they find out that it's uh, not real that's worse than you just being rude from the beginning you know somebody can take somebody being rude but being fooled that's a different thing well it's because well, my personal opinion is because it's really make sure it's do you think you're gonna keep losing power uh it's hard to tell okay. This house can get a little weird when it's hot out. Hey, hey, hey. You can't go to sleep yet. You still have to go over tomorrow. You just need to get some sleep. Okay. So, first, we're gonna hit up LaRue for brunch. Just remember, don't order any red meat. Mom hates that. Actually, I circled a few things on the menu, so why don't you just go with one of those? And then, we're off to the botanical... He sounds like Skinner from The Simpsons. Botanical Gardens. Mom's always raving about that place, and I think this would be your big chance to finally impress her, you know? I think you two will finally bond. I'm gonna have to step out for a little business call for like 20 minutes, but just stop. <laughs> Sam. Um, yep. Botanical garden, bonding. I know all this. <laughs> When was the last time you took your medication? I'll take it first thing tomorrow. Jesus Christ, babe, you can't keep... Calm down. You know those pills, they keep me up. How do you expect to impress her when you're batshit all weekend? <sighs> well, I, babe, I didn't mean it like that. It's just... Look, I know how hard you've been working. I just want this weekend to go great. Nothing bad can happen if I'm asleep. <laughs> Good night. Night. Hey. Famous last words, right? That's not a fucking creepy location. I don't know what is.
That kind of sound would probably wake me up too. Yeah, um, turn your volume up a little bit. Yes, sir. Um, All right, uh, um, like, uh, repeat what you were Just, saying. Can you hear me now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. No, I was saying uh, you were, you mentioned tension. I said that's because we can all relate to that. It builds and builds. Because anytime we get into some situation that uh, induces fear or anything, it's what starts building tension. Tension. It's like yeah, like it's said, it, and... said uncomfortable. The goal of horror to me, honestly, is to create intense discomfort in your seat. And mm -hmm. by discomfort, I don't mean shock of blood and uh, that. It's the down to earth, real human emotional stuff that we all can relate to. Then we go, oh, oh, okay, I'm feeling it now. You know, mm -hmm. that kind of thing. And this this movie kind of really nails it with the uh, the sound design. Because it's making it like, <clears throat> like it's it's making the quiet situation pulse, like the like that it's going like it, it's like the that, heart, yeah, that silent heartbeat, yeah, the silent heartbeat you hear in your mind like, kung, 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 okay, what's yeah. gonna happen next? Yeah, and you're going, oh, it's like as it, the... it, it 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 plays on our anxieties. Absolutely, it does. It's it's very Hitchcocky in this movie. Um... I can I can see why they did well on um, on the uh, F thirteen fan film. I can see why. All right, let's continue. Oh, uh, did you have? Did you want to say something? Oh no no no. Okay. Yeah. Good. Oh, what the fuck! Be shitting me. Oh. What the fuck? Now, when you say what the fuck, I'm trying to figure out whether it was what we just saw or the amount of grease they put. Yeah, that what, what the is what the fuck? <laughs> Look at that little later on head right there. Oh no no no! That's that that that's 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 that. Oh what the living hell! It's. It's it, it it's like pet cemetery. Oh. Oh. It's uh It's there. What the fuck? Yo. You know what I, you know what my my opinion on this is and how that like affects us is because when we when we visualize certain things like that we see things that are odd and are our, and, our, and we we're like what it doesn't add up and that creates fear in our in our inner minds like it's almost like when you see like a, a mannequin or something just a, or a human figure that doesn't yeah you're trying to uh, reconcile you're trying to your brain right, is trying yeah. to make sense of that shape it's um yeah uh -huh. and it goes this doesn't make sense in mm -hmm. in our human nature from before and through evolution and all this other stuff. Where it goes, you need to run from that because it's not right. Please leave. Um, right, and sorry. No, no, no. And there's it's a it's a funny thing that you mentioned that there's like um, the whole thing with the uncanny uncanny valley, um, mm -hmm. where we developed that instinct 
for a reason, and we're still, still not up. entirely sure why. Because it's not from it's not from like um, um, uh, it, it wouldn't like, be like do, Neanderthals. Do we even it wouldn't need be it? Uh, uh huh. Like it's like almost like do we even need that anymore? Or is it just a leftover instinct stuck in our brain that needs to? I think we do. I think I think I think it evolved for a reason. Like we we have a specific ability to tell when something isn't quite like like it's they're trying to pretend to be right real but but they're not like you know like when you can tell um that an ai even a well done one like an ai um script yeah you can tell yeah right like even when it's well done the clipping um the hard edge like uh that they say like when they structure their sentences it doesn't flow Mm -hmm like it's supposed to it doesn't flow like conversation like what we're now, doing Josh, here what you just said you can hmm. sum that up in what is it it's unnatural and hmm. i think our bodies say this is a natural stay away just like something doesn't sound natural with a smell or a we're very primitive we yeah still so have primitive things my question like is what hmm. in our past that was unnatural and it was so powerful that it hardwired into the very core of our being. Like it's in our it's in our fucking lizard brain. Like that shit's like you know at the right at the base. Like it's not right, coming like in out our, in like our early stages of development. What what was that? Because here's the thing, here's another thing. You make you make a great point because we don't we we think that oh we know our history of humanity and all that Mm -hmm. we have what people wrote for us okay we came we come into this world and we uh basically go oh look this is what's in the books and that's that but what you're mentioning about this when you're when you're questioning why like okay where did that develop in our brain to say okay uh stay away from that Mm -hmm. yes you know that that shit i think i say that on here right yeah 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 yeah. stay away from that uh that came for a reason like you said and it and it's and apparently we're still not quite sure what because like you know all you know we're a curious fucking lot you know we seek to understand everything about our world even when some of us refuse um you know like you know it's why we have scientists and always have yeah, had do, scientists. But, you know, we, Josh, we want th- to know. Do th- hmm. Josh, do you think that our brains assign meaning meaning to that? As in meaning like our brains say, okay, well, we never saw that in the past. But our brain, because y- you know how humans, we assign meaning to things. It's almost depressing how we find out some of our natural emotions are actually, you know, just our brains assigning meaning. Do you think that we assign some sort of meaning to that figure? Do you, do you know what I'm trying to get at? I think that, um, so, I think that somewhere in our early history, in the, um, hold on, one second, uh, in the, um, in the making of the modern human brain, you know, when we came to be right. homo sapiens, um there was there there was there there was uh, like the extra layer on top like you know like in the thing like the thing that allows us to be um like i i'm we we evolved to recognize something that was not supposed to be something that like right. um beyond natural dangers like you know and uh, uh, like you know like how and maybe it's linked to like how like when we cross an ocean and find a new land and um i'm not saying it started here but like it's an example and we find a new land and we look into a forest and all we see is darkness um you know and we have that instinctual fear of what's in the darkness 
Uh, now, because uh, darkness represents the unknown. Yes, yes, absolutely, and not only and that's that, our absolute human fear is the unknown. This is why we fear death because it's unknown. We think we know what's going. On. I'm not trying to hijack what you're saying. No, go ahead, go I'm ahead. Just, you, you you popped up and you said something that got me fired here. It's like that is one of the, our human emotions is the unknown. Mm -hmm. That is the cause of so many of our problems. Period. Well, our fear, not our, well, they, they cause problems because they cause fears. But it's fears also allowed us to dominate as a species. Yeah. So that fear like, of the it's, unknown, it's, it's, that fear of the unknown is the same. Uh, we, and because we have lesser eyesight now than we did as, uh, as uh, like, you know, in our, in our previous evolution... Our brain had to make up for that by being able to pick out the dangerous shapes in the darkness. Excuse me, I got my uh, my cat. Hold on one second. He swipes at the dark or at the door when uh, when he wants to come in. Um, it, it like so, we had to evolve a way to pick out shapes in the dark that were dangerous to us. Uh, well, and, that's that, well, that's how our brains work. Is they they find patterns. That's how our brains mm -hmm, work. We we, mm -hmm. we we assign meaning patterns, shapes, and we say, okay, this is dangerous, this and that. And uh, yeah, I agree. And uh, I think that's where part of the Uncanny Valley thing comes from. But the other part of it is like, um, like if there's any truth to extra normal encounters, like whether it be, be extraterrestrial or terrestrial, then that would probably be why we have like, uh, uh, that's not fucking normal. I need to run the other way. Right, it's like, it's like, it's like. But maybe it's also the they, fucking thing no, that allows us to tell crazy people, like when we know somebody is not fucking right in the head, and that we need to leave the uh, the vicinity. Yeah, because there's somewhere down the line in that, because what the one thing is, um, our cells carry information. Mm -hmm. Okay, that those we call them genes and whatever mm -hmm. you want to do it. So that's been carried on for so long. So at one point, it, you know, it's in our our nature just to, to you know the, that's how we evolved as a species and, and got here is we we avoided we learned hey okay that's that's trouble stay though. The Wait. weird thing is though is like we yeah. have not uh, we have not seen fit to get rid of it like even in our modern times like it serves us better than ever right and why do you think that our brains won't let that go is it is it purely survival or do you think it's the fact that our brains aren't actually as uh what's the word i don't want to say it sounds weird me saying oh i don't want to say human because it's a brain um i'm looking for more of a human behavior like uh, thing um uh, go ahead uh, i i think um i just think it's something that it serves us well and our, our like our species has not found fit to evolve past it and it may even be that it is part of uh, that it's part and parcel to what we are as people uh, it's the whole reason that we can't define the spark. We can't fucking say what the fuck it is. We can see it on an EEG, you know, or, or whatever it is, like the thing that like can see our brain patterns and all that. You know, we can yeah. see it, you know, like, you know, we can like, you know, like you can see it running through your body as the current of life. Like you can, you, you have electrical impulses, you make static and all that shit. Um, and when you die, it goes and you're just a meat puppet. Um... And, and yeah, but uh, go ahead. No go ahead. No, you you go ahead. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen, we're still trying to establish a rhythm. 
Uh, go ahead, sir. Yeah, uh, yeah. If, if, if I'm new to this whole thing. <clears throat> Oh, okay. So you're just gonna uh, okay. Um, oh, 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 sh oh, no. I'm sorry. I got into a thought process. Go ahead, man. All right, we're yeah, just gonna uh, jump back into the film. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> sorry, sorry. <laughs> we'll we'll do better. I'm, uh, I'm 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 learning my ropes. Yeah, we're both are. We've all thought this is a new format, ladies and gentlemen. Not quite new, but it's it's a new like it's it's a new dynamic. There we go. Josh, 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 pause real quick. Yes, sir. No, no, and go back to where she where where there's where she's um through that uh, frosty glass that figure. All right, go. Okay, and um, hold on. Uh, all right, press play real quick. Okay, when her. Okay, this, now pause it real quick. Okay, this, I don't know what it is and what, uh, I think that plays into something because that's a human figure, okay? I think the brain says, because to me, that's a little bit creepier than, oh, mm -hmm. uh, ooh, Mr. Scary, something, whatever. That just looks like something creeping along that my brain says, hey, I don't want to have any part of this. I want to get the out you know what i mean right and, and um maybe it's also do, linked to um ter uh, telling the difference between an animal predator and a human predator hmm. but, but but what's animal about this because she has oh, her, 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 whole, her, her whole movement was uh animal i mean you can tell that it was a human yeah but, but... we're also animals though that's that, that looks, to me, that's true. We're not we're not separate I, I from the saying. animal kingdom, but we do not move like a jaguar that. would move, or or even a primate would move, or yeah, um, I, think, I think you just said it. I think you just said it right there without saying it. You basically just said the movement is unnatural. Our brains see that they go that kind of movement is unnatural. Hey, guess what? You need to stay away. Yeah, maybe that's the thing. Um, that too, it's like when we, um, like we're not, I mean, sometimes we get lucky and our reflexes are fast enough, but like when we see out of the corner of our eye, like a snake or, uh, uh, a dangerous insect or, uh, something that we can dodge in the last second, you know, that kind of thing that's also linked to that yeah. whole, um, like, cause humans, like we're, 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 we're a very, our senses are very dulled compared to everything else in the animal kingdom. Um, yeah, our senses are dulled, and they also give us very wrong signals at times. So we're like it's doing this balancing act. And then we have emotions yeah. too. Well, we have stronger. And like, yeah, I wouldn't our even emotions say get in the way. Yes, yeah. we we allow our emotions to get in the way a lot of the time. Like uh, we we don't well, rely as uh, much on instinct time. as we used to. All right, let's continue because I want to see what this fucking creepy yeah. ass lady is up to. Yeah, go ahead. Oh fuck! It's not an. Uh, is it? Is it an illusion or is it? Oh, that's not good. That's got. You better scoop, mother. Uh, you better scoop, baby. <laughs> Why'd you put the bottle? In the <laughs> I I don't know. I, I don't know why she didn't scoop. Like those are those are. Oh, what the fuck? Yes, yes. It's got you. Uh, oh my. Oh. oh. Okay, hold on. Josh, Josh, pause real quick. And th that kind of shit. <laughs> this right here, this is what I'm talking about. This is, this, I'll take this over. Oh, I'm going to hack you up all day. Yeah, 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 yeah. Eyeballs, that look, <laughs> if I saw that, and that, that actually, uh, it, it taps into this fear of yeah. mine. And seeing that crap, because I think, okay, Real quick, that thing is going to eat me. We, we, we've all woken up in the middle of the night and had to go pee when we were kids, and we're like, "Do I have to go down that hallway?" Absolutely. And you're and you're thinking, and and what my brain is telling me right now is, 
I don't want to see that shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So I would literally jump from Look my bed to the doorway and dash into the bathroom as fast as I fucking could. Uh, and oh, when I had to go to the other bathroom, I would literally, I would literally have to fucking make sure all the lights are on across the down the hallway, and then I would. I would turn the lights off and dash down the hallway and jump back into my bed. Like it was like I like there was a there was an octopus monster underneath my bed. I was convinced of it. Josh, am I I hear you, man. Josh, if at my house did did you ever use the bathroom down uh the hallway um in my house the the house where I grew up in? Yeah. Uh, uh, so uh if... Remember okay, you know where it is? Sort of, yeah, 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 yeah. It, it's been a long time. But okay, so I go down there, and what what I'm trying to say is, the toilet is by the shower, and I'm not. <coughs> Good. So there's a, a shower curtain. So I'm, I'm like, I gotta go pee, man. So, as a little kid, <laughs> so I'm peeing, and next to me is a shower curtain, and my biggest oh. fear was that shit's. Just, just gonna be ripped open, yeah. and I'm gonna see this weird thing like that. Go ahead, man. Hell yeah. That's like a fear. That's like one of the like innate primal fears. Yeah, yeah. Something's and, gonna. And I, and I used to think like, like, like. I remember when my grandmother died. I was that's like, from Psycho. Oh, shit. You got Psycho. that from you got that from Psycho. It's a good point. I don't even think about it. And I think I think it sits in in my subconscious. Sits in everybody's subconscious. It has since that movie yeah. was made. All right, let's go on with creepy eyeballs over here. All right. <laughs> See what she's up to. No, good guy. Whoever, if this was, like, it it looks like maybe it was filmed in reverse. I I don't know. Like, I hope it was. Uh, I hope oh, it's practical. Josh. Josh, go back. Go back. Go back. I'm gonna tell you something real quick. Go back. Just a little bit back when she did the creepy thing that you were talking about, because you made a good point. No, go back a little more. Okay, she's doing that. Yeah, see that? That is. Yeah, go back to where she's coming through the doorway there. Okay, yeah, you just stop. Well, yeah, this. See, this is unnatural movement. Mm -hmm. Buddy goes, that's not normal. Mm hmm. I went out, and this is what horror, to me at least, I'm getting all freaking like, it it signals that's not a natural. Get the hell away from it. Yeah. Do you see the movement? You know what I'm trying to say? Yeah, absolutely. Like watch. Yeah. Oh, hey, like it's it's it's, it's the, the shot is quick. Hold on. Dude, I'll, I'll take it. Is good, dude. Oh, it, the, look at look at that. Hey. Look, what is that? Hey, I'm trying to. Dude, your your black your black color, like you know your black um, uh, whatever's not showing through right now, but it looks like she's grabbing onto a. Anyway, go ahead and play. Look at that. Oh 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 yeah, I see. Okay, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's not a natural body. Nope. Oh fuck. No, no, no. She wants to have a conversation. You better take that. Yes. Huh? <laughs> I said, what does she want to have a conversation with, though? I wouldn't have a conversation. Wouldn't have a conversation with that. I just want to get away from it. <laughs> I like. I, I, I did, like, but, I, but I, I hear what you're saying, though. Like, uh, like uh, whatever is fucking crawling to her, she definitely wants to fucking. She wants something. She's she's trying to get up in her yeah, face and get, shit. Get away. <laughs> get away. So this is definitely a, her struggle with mental illness. You know, um, obviously, like the pain, uh, the meds are for like um, her. Um, Wait, what do you mean? Uh... We haven't even gotten to the, uh, to what's really going on. I thought this was like, well, no, she like it, um, every time she takes the pill, like, uh, or she like, uh, or focuses, like the monster disappears. Uh, hey, Josh, what is what is it called when it's uh, like? Josh, what is it called when like it's like 
it's like, it's a false uh not a false it's a false frame or false image of what you're seeing illusion um no, no yeah no i know what that is or it's, delusions uh, uh uh like uh no, no not the delusion no it uh, it's like when you see something and it's just, uh it's like delicately balancing between delusions and just our images and our uh what our minds create for us sometimes i'm trying to figure out like okay what, i mean what usually that's seeing? usually that's dreaming like when like uh we're trying to make sense of everything we've fucking seen during no, the day it's not a dream but uh we don't have time to freaking go through what i'm <laughs> trying to do so let's hit the play button okay But she's definitely got to be struggling. She's definitely struggling with mental illness. Yeah. Like even her husband was saying, like, you, "Did you take your pills?" Well, what, what do you, well, what do you think she has? Um, is that's not anxiety, dude? No, <laughs> you, um, don't, you, you don't see much just crawling across the floor. She, uh, she probably. Um, I mean, I, I'm no, I'm no, I'm no doctor. I couldn't fucking like. She sees things. Like if she's. She has um, um, uh, episodes where she sees things, uh, and it it might be in, uh, anxiety induced. It may be a lot of things, uh, but she's definitely struggling to 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 keep in to stay in reality. Um, and it's Her own it's little an, well personal hell. Well, yeah, I mean, like, it, it's a, it's, to us, it's affecting the real world, like, she literally opened, the, the thing opened the door, and was opening the fucking, like, curtain and everything, so in her mind, like, it's real, uh, like, Wait, you know. Hold on, Josh, Josh, what you just said right now, when you said, in her mind, that's key, because people need to understand that, like, okay, this might not, like, okay, if she's doing, if it, if it is some sort of mental thing and she's seeing things or she's uh experiencing this anxiety that's producing this uh intense stress or something that's causing her brain to do whatever to see that i don't know how much stress it takes to see a damn that weird thing crawling across but my point is it, it uh... yes I, I i sorry i paused because I thought I had the name for the psychological disorder, and I went. It'll come to oh, you. No, I don't. I, no, I went. No, I, no. I was literally. Like, Josh was like this. I was like, no. I just is it paranoid totally schizophrenia? I, I, a, no, I think it's. Uh, well, what could it be? Yeah, it might be paranoid schizophrenia. Let's find out. It's getting late. It, it's, yeah, it's just that just roll. Uh, see see what the fuck so like uh like uh is it getting to the point where like it's it's actually affecting the real world because that's a fucking handprint and that's not her handprint well how, and how does she know that that's she's even in the real world that's even more terrifying at least to me yeah am i in the world what am i seeing what everybody else is seeing is this is this real that's terrifying that kind of thing being trapped in your own mind that's horrifying to me if you want to if you want to be a horror uh if you want to like create a horror movie yeah it, like for me being trapped in your mind yeah yeah go ahead sorry oh yeah absolutely being but, stuck yeah. in the loop uh the depressing loop yeah. of the worst scenarios possible yeah that's fucking terrifying because, because we all live in our minds whether we uh want to say whether we live here and there we're we live in our minds that's the only place and there's no escape so mm -hmm. and, right. and when and when if you sit down and think about it it's terrifying Go ahead. it is uh um like uh, and how many people can't convey uh the the hell that they're in you know right. it, so um yeah that's, that's uh, it makes you it makes you uh just be glad you don't have to deal with that shit yes I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen. It's just getting late, and uh, I have to keep him on track because um, he'll he'll stray. Um, I'm a rambler. I apologize. I'm I'm gonna yes. try to close my mouth here. I get analytical, and I'm 
start thinking and I'm interrupting his stream and it's not a stream. A... This is just a video. We're not even live. Oh, no, video. Not whatever, yet. Whatever. I'm... <laughs> Sorry. I mean, we're recording, but we're not live. You know, like we're not like five people aren't watching us it's just like it's just me and you uh watching a video together yes. and uh we're gonna put this into the ether in the morning so uh yeah um the let... ether i like that uh, term yes sir uh, i'm hoping y'all like it um hold but... on hold on josh real quick that handprint yes sir what does that remind you of like what i mean as as, as symbolic um it's gonna hit it's it, it's gonna hit you watch notice Okay, count the fingers and look where the thumb is. I think they were putting a little <laughs> hint. I don't know. Like let, let's 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 see does, where it does, goes. Huh? Because it does look so like she was just like peeking over the uh, over the tub. Yeah, look at it. Have you ever grabbed anything? Your thumb is going to be closer. Okay, I'm analyzing too hard here. Go ahead. <laughs> Sorry. The thumb should be closer to that because if she would, if she, go ahead. Man. Yeah, uh, yeah. Actually, if if she was, gra uh, do you see what I'm saying? Do you see what I'm saying though? It it, it might be like just a production or error like that. It most it, it might is. be because Probably. they just want it, you it, to it see the no whole handprint. Yeah, okay. See, this is this is another thing right now. Is that see, this is what this is doing is I'm my brain right now is giving meaning to that little uh, miss um, placement of the thumb because, and that was just probably just somebody working on the production crew. It was like, oh yeah, we just need to put this on here. I and mean, my even the uh, now, even the pinky is a little off. Oh. Damn, Josh, yeah, you're, yeah, you're right, bro. <laughs> yeah, because it wouldn't no, naturally, it wouldn't dude, naturally fall like, like that. And the piggy looks like a little broken. Yeah, it is. It, it 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 wouldn't it wouldn't lie like that. Like that doesn't look natural. Like oh, the only thing that looks natural is maybe the two, like the 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 four, the ring finger and the middle finger, like uh, the um the the, the 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 last two fingers look like they were like somebody was just trying the trying to wing the rest of it <laughs> yeah you're right <laughs> yeah, yeah. Right. oh oh, oh, shit. oh shit. Can't do that. well you just that now you pissed off mother oh oh shit now that's a correct handprint somebody just like put their hand in ink oh shit oh shit oh shit Go what? What? There's the legs. What the? F okay, J Josh, pause right there. That. That is terrible. That to me, that that simple. That's the uncanny valley. It's not human. It looks like it's Josh. it's trying to be human, but it's not quite there. Do you, do you know what that that triggers images of real quick? And I'm gonna make it as, as fast. And I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. Remember. It's. Splatter, Splatterhouse. Un, un... Okay, I don't need to talk. Go ahead. <laughs> I just that one. You're right. And I know exactly what you're talking about. <laughs> Go ahead, man. That's a good still, and that's... too. Yeah, that, that's... Uh... Oh, and she's trying it's to fucking looks... record it, too. Why would you do that? Oh. You know what I'd be doing. See, see, she, she knows, like, uh, like, oh, oh my God, that, like, hold on, like, that was fucking good, uh, like, I don't care what it, what, let's, let's, can we, so definitely CGI, okay. um, but, uh, well, well, hold on, hold on, hold on, I don't think it's full CGI, I think it's CGI combined with practical effect. I, it I might really be like because so. like this no, it is. might be this a, was... it, it might be a mask. It might just be you know how like they they don't have the it's the um, not necessarily the hero mask, 
but the one that's like medium range shots, like uh, we just caught the like bed. the ones they give for extras or something like that. Yeah, that but it looks real. Like it, like if you weren't looking hard enough, you would like looks, it would still looks like, real enough for what we need it for. That that kind of thing you're trying to say. Yeah, because see where the mouth is like that. It looks like it's just like you know like everything is good up here, and then right here yeah. it's just there to fucking like uh be it, like because nobody's gonna see this except for. Uh, like nerds like us that are fucking super over analyzing everything, including like handprints. Yeah, maybe that's <laughs> the whole thing here. Could be like uh, this is what happens when you're like you're stuck in your own maybe, head too. Maybe we're just not meant to watch these kind of things because we <laughs> analyze it too much. Hell no. Not, no, no, they, no, 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 hell no. <laughs> uh, uh, um, like I'm down. Like I, like I, like no, 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 no. Like uh, we gonna watch them. We uh, we all gonna watch them uh like uh, no, no, uh no 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 i mean like maybe they just think oh well, we're gonna fool these guys and we're over here going no you know what this and that and that you know what her vein on her nose doesn't look like it belongs to going up to not <laughs> no i bet you was like i bet you was like harold we have 75 bucks left in the fucking <laughs> fx <said> budget <laughs> we have 75 <laughs> bucks left in the fx budget we're using the the medium mask but they're gonna pause it. It's gonna be fine. No so one's gonna too. notice it, but the fucking two nerds that are up at two in the morning. <laughs> All right, who the fuck has the hero mask? Oh shit, it was there burned. Oh fuck, okay. Right, somebody Where's stole that for that? another movie. Somebody took that for the for the next movie. <laughs> or the the the, the prop the prop uh, the person in the prop. Uh... Now in movies, it is it the prop? Uh, is it the production designer that hands the props, or is it? Do they have a different thing? I, I think the production designer handles like the broad. Because has to create this whole view. What I was trying to say was he basically said, "Uh oh, well, this would be I think the I lost yeah, something." The, Here, the, take this because I've done this at work in a different way. We all have. I, I believe uh, this would be the, uh, still under the purview of the FX uh, guy because he would have like the the set of right. um, the set of um, right. masks that are the hero masks or the ones that he can co uh, like other people can copy. Um, yeah. So this like I like like I said from the top like from the nose up it looks really good. It's just they they only needed the fucking shit to look good while she looks up because it's only real quick and I had to fucking. I had to come back for this shot, like you know, and it, you know, it, you know, like this is, it's just a good shot yeah, to but, to speak to talk but, on. But Josh, what do you think about okay? The fact that you paused it, it totally changed how I look at it. Yeah, it becomes like okay, I can see it. I can. Yeah, uh, because you shit. It, it oh, lost, it lost it. Lost the illusion. Oh, but think? then it, but then it switches. Okay. Like uh, like now you can see her, you can see the teeth like warping in the bottom that is right, definitely that's that's cgi switching now like they're like um so maybe that was um the transition like right where we we're starting where it went from the rubber mask to like the cgi dude look at that like right like see where right here right there this reminds me of the walking dead oh the, the base uh it, it does is that or they were is that or they're like well we don't have enough money in the uh production budget here to <laughs> make another denture for the lower base so you need to just i'm gonna go put some things in there and the lighting will work on that so it looks like it's doing something don't don't get us on the, uh, don't go don't get us on the ban list, man. Like you know, like you know, like that. Hey yeah, guys, uh, uh, guys, guys, if you're watching, like we love your work. It, it, he, it, 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 oh no, 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 dude, no, dude, oh don't, oh, no, dude, I don't mean that. No, I, I'm just saying, like I've I've learned. <laughs> you laughing at me because you know I'm like. Why did you explain? Blah, blah. I get, I get, I get, I get to mess with it. Continue with the show. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh. Look at that. Look, 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 look. Okay, okay, let's just finish. Oh, like let's, let's let's get to it. I want to see her. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. 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 Oh she oh. Look at that. Okay, that's pretty good fucking production work. Uh even uh, you Josh, know, huh? Just run it again real quick. What's again? Um, 
Yeah, hold on. Go, go back. You paused it real uh, too early. Just go back like two seconds. That's right there. All right. All right. Good. Oh, and you could you can actually see the actress right there. I, either that or it's the tongue. Yeah, 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 yeah. it looks like the actress. I don't know. That looked very weird. I think it was the actress, like a uh, doing a thing with the oh my, oh my. What the fuck? That was pretty fucking good. She like looked like she was trying to corrupt her or some shit. <laughs> yeah. Oh no! Sorry. I'm so sorry. We're okay. just gonna let it go just from here. Stop. I'm gonna pull it out. <laughs> oh, 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 I see. That ain't good. Sam, what the hell? Mark. Mom? Mom! No, 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 no. What'd you do? Wow. She attacked me. Call 911. Hold on. Please. Mom. Mom. We need an ambulance. Tell them to hurry. Who gives a shit? I need an ambulance. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Don't tell me to call Her mom. eyes are like Oh shit! Zero Ash Stop Road. Yes. Please hurry. Someone is going to die. So it's not just her. There is something going on. Oh, there's something going on. Mark? Shit. Mark. Nope, Mark isn't here anymore. Mark! No, Mark. Only soon. Bring it on, motherfucker! Ooh. That was really good. I'm sorry we paused it a whole bunch. I couldn't stop him. Yeah, we didn't apologize to anybody that uh, my uh, interruptions. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Um, we were we were analyzing the film. Uh, we were looking at the uh, FX, especially um, in a, a small film like this. Like uh, like it's really nice to look at their labor. And um, uh, and Josh, one thing is. People don't, I don't think people understand how much work it takes to make this. Like, yes. And I'll, and I just, for me, for example, like, and I'm sure everybody else thought this. I used to think when I was a kid that, okay, well, this just, this just sets itself up and, uh, some person is just recording it. No, it's, uh, it takes a lot of work. You got to set up the cinematography, the mm -hmm. lighting, People, and people, lighting is another thing people forget about. Like, it takes a lot of work to do this stuff, and it's hard for people to respect that, that don't understand it. But I see it, and it's like, and, and Josh knows because he's got the artistic talent. You know what I'm trying to say, Josh? So I'm trying to I do. Um, I used to do some 3D modeling and uh, just uh, doing like 10 seconds of work. Well, well uh, Josh, you're just talking about forever. practical stuff. Like oh yeah, I know, like but and, um, it, and even in so um, even in three D modeling, you still have to uh, oh, you yeah. still have to build everything to to make it look real. Like it's still same. Yeah. It takes it takes just as long, uh, and it used to take fucking like a week for fucking to to make a film, like uh, through like uh, to render the film. Uh, so, but with practical, like that's just uh, straight like hours of 
prep time, uh, um, like a build time, then filming and like and reshoots, and you have your actors like in uncomfortable positions for hours and hours and hours and hours and hours, and then they have to come out of that makeup, uh, and that's after they get in the makeup and spend those hours and hours and hours and hours and hours. So yeah, it's an exhaustive process. Yeah. Now, do you remember earlier, Josh, when, no, this is uh, off uh, everything, we were talking about Alien, how I, I reanalyzed Alien and mm -hmm. realized this is a freaking masterpiece. Absolutely. Do you know what they, do you know what they did? Hmm. What they, how they created, um, so do you remember when the, um, the thing opened up that, the, the face hugger, they, they actually, they used actual. And this is good. this goes back to what I'm talking about. They used real effects. anatomy, and um, they were yeah. They used they used the cow stomach. Yeah. In there, and and and, and everything stank. In the do yeah, and in the documentary, they say, "Do you see the difference of what like using some biological material makes as opposed to later on like aliens and Alien mm -hmm. Three and when you way, could, Josh, um, using saw... something that you can identify." Right, it just looks. You can't. You cannot. I don't think. Personally, I don't think you can simulate that biological look. Like you look at that and it looks visceral. Um, not without. Um, not without exceptional um, input. Um, like, so that's the thing. Oh, yeah, like, uh, if you wanted, if you want anything like that's um, digital to look real, you're going to have to reference everything in the real world to simulate um, well, the biological the movement like you would you would literally need the motion capture for whatever animal you're simulating you would need uh, like uh, all the textures and you would need the rigging uh, like everything like it's uh, um, it goes down to how much effort you're gonna put into your th uh, uh, 3d like uh, and the best 3D is the 3D you never ever see. Like hands down. Oh, um, it's like makeup. But um, makeup. I, I I really do have to end this um, here. Um, okay. I have to go to work. Um, so um, let me just close it out for uh, for you guys on YouTube. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, this uh, new format. Um, it's, um, I told you I was going to be experimenting with some new, uh, new things. Um, this is one of them. Um, and, um, I'm very excited and I want to do more of these. Um, and, uh, Dave will get his Especially chops in. Womp Stomp, by the way. Uh, Especially yes, this is a Womp Stomp film. Um, let me go ahead and so, uh, sub to them. I'm sure Josh will have better coming... Oh yeah, we're gonna watch the uh, yeah. the Jason uh, fan film um, later, uh, probably uh, tomorrow or maybe this weekend when I have a. Uh, you energy know I'm to a dork out on that, dude. Yes, you will. <laughs> um, but so, until then, so ladies and gentlemen. All, um, sorry, go ahead. no, go ahead, go ahead. No, I was just gonna say. Let me just uh, sign off here. Yeah, um, I'm probably gonna dork out on that if he if Josh decides he wants me to uh, come and pop in and. Give my uh, commentary here. I will uh, on that. Uh, as far as it comes to Friday Thirteenth and, and what the fan film. Oh shit! Uh, sorry. Uh, repeat yourself, Dave. I had the I had the my alarm went off. Oh sorry. Um, no, when it goes to um, I lost my train of thought, man. It's it's late yeah. for me too, man. I, yeah. Um. <laughs> I used to wake up five thirty and I'm, I'm for work and I'm, I'm I'm my brain is going. I don't understand right. how to work. Um, this um I, I got I got this, Dave. Yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed. Um, um, look forward to more content uh, like this. Um, this will be up to um uh, sometime this week. Um, be safe, be happy, be healthy. I love you all, and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>